7 Strange Animal Species That Have Recently Been Discovered Sarilobris finifenma This bright fish was first discovered by scientists in the 1990s, but they only recognized it as an adult version of a known species at the time. Nevertheless, a study in March revealed that this particular swimmer, Sarilobris finifenma, is actually its own distinct species. These fish often referred to as rose-veiled fairy wrasse, come in a variety of colors, but they all have a scattering of stripes and a fan of fins running along the top and bottom of their bodies. These fish dash across the gloomy reefs off the coast of the Maldives, according to the analysis's authors, and their identification emphasizes how many questions yet exist about our oceans. Synapturanus Donta Although Synapturanus donta appears to be an easy find due to its large nose and resemblance to the Amazonian taper, its modest stature and propensity to burrow have allowed it to elude biologists for a very long time. Until scientists discovered that this small, taper-like frog is anything but silent. A team of scientists gathered multiple specimens of the amphibians after hearing their harsh sounds coming from the jungle floor of the Amazon, and they validated their classification as a new species for a paper that was published in February. The team believes that these elusive frogs are a positive indication of the region's health and stand for the region's hidden biodiversity, which is tucked away beneath the forest floor. Scaloporus weechol while some species are discovered in the wild, others are found in the meticulously preserved collections of museums. A reportedly new species of spiny lizard, Scalopora suichol, was discovered by experts after carefully examining specimens from nearly 10 different research organizations. This once unknown creature, which scurries through the mountainous jungles of central Mexico, is covered in spiky scales and differs from related species such as S. torquatus and S. melanogaster by virtue of its slightly smaller size and peculiar color. The Weechol, an indigenous group that lives in the same area, is where the name of the spiny species comes from, said the study's authors. Lamarck Dromia beagle a family of crustaceans known as sponge crabs scurries around the ocean's shallows and other areas where sea sponges are abundant. Why? These crabs, however, use sea sponges and other immobile sea organisms as a type of artistic camouflage that they collect, clip, and wear on their shells. Scientists are already aware of numerous species of these cunning crabs but an examination from April revealed a peculiar new crab around the western Australian beaches. Lamarck Dromia beagles have fluffy coats that are shaggy, surprisingly soft, according to scientists, which may act as an additional layer of camouflage to protect the species from predators. Otis P. K. Gila. While some newly discovered species are widely distributed, others have only been found in the most isolated distant areas of the globe. Otis P. K. Gila, a unique species of scops owl found only on Principe, a small island in Africa's Gulf of Guinea is a prime example of this. According to a study from October, the Principe scops owl inhabits an area of around 6 square miles and is restricted to the island's native woodlands. The population still has between 1,000 and 1,500 people, which is a healthy number. However, the scientists suggested that the species be listed as critically threatened due to the owl's limited native range. The authors accomplished this concurrently with their announcement of its finding, illuminating the ambiguity of bird biodiversity in a context of ongoing global change. Atoyer Anoldzi Biologists thought that all Atoya jellies shared a common trailing tentacle that they swayed with shorter appendages to grab their dinner as they floated across the sea before discovering this species. As a result, the discovery of an animal that resembled the Atoya but was missing its trail raised a lot of concern. In a report published in April, scientists described much more about Atoya Renoldsi than just its lack of an extremity. 
In reality, the unusual species has bumps all over it and coils the few short tentacles it does have into coils close to its body. Scientists say that although a Toya Renoldsi is uncommon, research should be done to safeguard the creatures that do exist in the ocean's depths. Bradipus crinitus Despite the fact that some 5,000 different species of mammals have already been recognized by biologists, many more are likely hiding in plain sight, waiting to be formally identified. In fact, it can be challenging to distinguish the individuality of many of these mammals because of how closely they resemble the recognized species. For instance, it appears that there are actually two species of sloth in the area, one from the north and one from the south of the region rather than the single species that researchers long believed to be ambling around the forests of Brazil. Bradipus torquatus, a northern variant, was discovered for the first time back in 1811. Bradipus crinitus, a southern variant, was discovered in a study in September, in part because of its flatter skull, 